Okay. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do first? What do I want to do first? Ooh, it's nighttime. Um, let's go check out over here. I want to see what this building is. Easy peasy. Piece of cake. What have we got here? Umi's restaurant. Mmm, I just love the smell of seafood. Man, this sunlight is making me look more pale than normal today. Oh, uh, welcome. I'm happy to see anyone in here at the moment, even a dog. There just isn't any fresh fish available these days. Hardly got any customers at all. We're well known for our chef, Mr. Umi's fresh fish dinners, dishes. I hope you'll get to try one of them. Goodness gracious, whatever will I do? Even I, the great chef Umi, can't cook without ingredients. I'm at the end of my rope. This dude's a cat. <clears throat> Cyclo Chef Umi! Listen, doggy, can I bend your furry little air? There's no good fish here lately, and I can't cook without fish! I feel like I'm starting to lose my touch! I've had enough! There's gotta be something good around here that'll make a good meal. Hey, what are you looking at? No, be too much effort getting all that fur off of you. I just need some juicy fruits with the sea to show what I can do. They must be fresh! It's an insult to the sea and the fish if the dish goes wrong. I don't know where the story is with the water dragon. I do know that the fish I need aren't being caught. So I've asked the fisherman. I can't do any more than that. I guess all I need to do is sit tight and wait for good news. Huh. Uh, let's do it a cat person. Like, literally a, a cat person. I'm surprised his name isn't like... Neko. Neko Umi. Ooh, treasure chest. Dig, 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 dig. Scaroon. I obtained a crystal. Foxes. Eat up, little foxies. Love me. What's up, Cory? Oh, 
Cool, cool. It is too early. But alas, you gotta do what you gotta do. Dig, 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 dig. Kitties. What good kitties? You know, if 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 the great goddess origin to all that is good and mother to us all for a pig she would have been called Hamaterasu That was a good one, and you know it. <laughs> I don't actually care what these merchants have to say, they don't have anything important to say. One last time for these awful puns before you've had your coffee. Uh, firstly, they're great puns. Secondly, very fair. Coffee is very important. It's one of the most important meals of the day. buy that new skill. Okay. Um, I know I wanted to beat the water dragon today, but now I have, I have enough money to go, uh, to go buy that, that that technique from Mr. Onigiri. So I'm gonna go pop on over there, learn Brown Rage, and uh, and cry after I learn it. Because for some reason, the game has decided that. Amaterasu needs to uh, poop on her enemies. Yes, no, I'm pretty sure. I'm, I'm pretty sure that is exactly what Brown Rage is going to be, and I'm not looking forward to it. But it lets me collect demon horns, and that's what matters. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna catch his Haya. What? Okay, I guess I'm not gonna catch Hayate. Yeah! No, that's why I'm expecting it to be poop. Because this is the upgraded version of that ability. Yes, it is Japan, which is why I thought you know there'd be. A little bit more respectful of the great goddess of Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. But I guess... I guess not! What's up, Bunagiri sensei Just here to learn. Oh! It's not 200,000! It's 2 million yen! Wow, okay, I'm nowhere near that. 
never mind. Never mind. I'm slightly relieved now. Slightly relieved that I misplaced that decimal point. On the other hand, I'm also very disappointed that it costs 2 million yen to poop on my enemies. Man, this sunlight is, is at a really weird angle. Amaterasu is a goddess, she doesn't need to poop. Wait, I wonder. Let me test a theory here. Oh no, it doesn't. I thought it would have, uh. Okay, yeah, no amount of brush work is gonna fix that. Um. Yeah, on the one hand, I'm kind of relieved that, uh. I don't have to get to poop on my enemies yet. On the other hand, I'm very disappointed that it costs 2 million yen to do so. Are these people playing Pokemon? Whoa there! Hey, you're in Shima, so you got taken by that Porka guy, right? He took you to a castle at the bottom of the sea? That's true, where's that Porka now, huh? Yeah, where is he now? Yeah, where is he? What are they talking about? It ain't Porka, it's Orca! He's an emissary of the Dragon Palace. And he only comes for people worthy of going there. Yeah, right. Didn't your mom teach you not to tell lies? Let's get him! Yeah. Get him! Wow. Why are kids the worst? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Well, we can't gang up on people like that. Hey, who's that? Good time and I'm bored of playing with him now. Come on, let's go play somewhere else. Yeah! Let's go play! Man, kids are the worst. What do you think those little brats were talking about, Amy? What do they mean by a castle at the bottom of the sea? Hmm. Hey, kid, I don't plan on staying like that. Hey, I'm walking to you, talking to you. I'm talking to you, kid. What's wrong, kid? Hey, kid. Hello? Anyone home? Hmm? I must have dozed off. I reckon I do that a lot on the beach. Fisherman, Urashima. I don't know who y'all are, but I appreciate you waking me up. When I got the strength to go home, sometimes I nap here. You are sleeping? Ah, you really have to worry to unstow or so like that. You're not sick or injured, are ya? No, sir. I'm fit as a fiddle, I am. Just taking a nap on the beach is all. Oh, well, that's a relief. Anyway, what was that about a castle at the bottom of the sea? You mind filling us in? No one ever believes me about that. There's a land under the sea here in Ryushima. The Dragonians and Sea God live there in the Dragon Palace. Dragon Palace is an amazing place, real pretty. I haven't been there in a dog's age though. Dragon Palace? Land of the Dragonians? They're the ones controlling the water dragon. Himiko said so. So how does one get there, what little boy? How could a chubby, uh, I mean, big boned lad like you elude that water dragon? And make it all the way down to the bottom of the sea. The water dragon was much nicer in those days. But you can't just choose to go to the Dragon Palace, see? Only worthy people can go. If you're worthy, an emissary called Orca comes to get ya. Now this Orca dude is an emissary from the Dragon Palace. Just how do you get to meet this guy anyway? Well, that's one question that ain't so easy to answer. Y'all see the pair over yonder? Yeah. What's about it? 
That pair's where I met Orca. I was looking out to see you when he came with the morning sun. Orca only comes if you're worthy of the Dragon Palace, I reckon. So I guess I gotta figure out a way to get be worthy of the Dragon Piggies! You think you know this myth? I'm not super familiar with Japanese mythology, so I can't say I know too much about it. But it seems legit. Sea Dragon Kami. He's made from coal. Well, well, aren't you a fine looking wolf? White as snow. What you doing in an old beach house like this then? I ain't got nothing for you, but you can rest here if you like. But Cory, I have an important question about this this Kami person. Oh here we go. Fisherman rescues the turtle and return the turtle camps for him to visit the Dragon Palace. Interesting. But but uh, it still doesn't change the important question I have about this sea dragon, Kami. Is Kami Kawaii? Water all brown. How do I fix this? Oh, well, there's a face I know. Well, of course, he means a beautiful princess and returns to find several hundred years have passed. It's been a while, Poochie. Hey, you're that apple guy who was over by the drawbridge. We didn't see him in the city. What you doing here? I'm sure kawaii ness is a matter of perspective. Okay, well, do you consider Kami to be kawaii? Well, I've had a complete change of heart since then. I gave up my old job and set off on a journey to hone my skills. This suits me much better than my formal duties back in the city. Nippon's best archer and his bow, Golden Fire, are still in top form. Depends on the kami. Well, you said it was the Sea Dragon kami. Hey, Poochie, why not have a bite to eat and relax a bit? What is this, some sort of training to hone your skill? I don't find Ryujin all that kawaii. Oh, that's a shame. You got it! See that fruit hanging on that tree over in that little island? That's what I'm aiming for. I'm going right back to the basics. But that fruit is as hot as stone. Nothing damages, even if I hit it dead center at a hundred dead center a hundred times. Sounds strange, but that's what makes it a good target. Hey, Poochie, why don't have a bite to eat and relax a bit? Hmm. So I can't just cut it up. Ew, that water is all yellow! Why did I drop in there? Don't- Amy, stop dropping in there, that's gross. This water is not clean. Jellyfish have no bones? Oh, that's horrible! I gotta feed the bun buns!
did Ryujin eat the eat the bones from the jellyfish? Or did he just like punish them and just go, oh, no bones for you? Yes, buddies, give me your praise. Worship me, for I am the great goddess Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. I got a golden peach. He beat them until all their bones were crushed? You know, Thor threatened to do that to Loki once. I got a stray bead. I got a poor statue. Uh, let me see if I can find the exact myth. I know which one it is. Let me just see if I can find the word in. Uh, Penguin Book of Norse Myths. There you are. Let's see. Ah, yes. All morning, Sif had sobbed and sobbed. She knew and Thor knew that only Loki would have shorn her hair. Well, what are you going to do about it? Well, what are you going to do about it, Drew? Demanded Thor. I'll replace it, yelped Loki. I'll get help from the dwarves. I promise to replace it. Or else, said Thor, and he dumped Loki on the ground. Loki raised both hands and cautiously explored the top of his head. Or else, said Thor, I will smash every bone in your body. Loki straightened his clothes and smoothed his hair, and then suddenly he winked at Thor. He hurried out of Asgard over Bifrost and down into the land of the Dark Elves. Uh, in Neil Gaiman's version, it, it's a bit more amusing because he's just like, Loki, if you do not replace my wife's hair, I imagine it would take me about 24 hours to break every bone in your body. And then, over time, I imagine I would eventually get better at it, to the point where I could probably do it in under an hour. Now, if you do not replace my wife's hair, I will make sure that I break your bones as soon as they repair. Every single time. And that, that is true love. I built a tree. What? A person appeared? Bunnies! Oh, I need to restock my uh, food packs.
but imagine imagine pissing Thor off so much that he's like, oh hello doggy have you come to see cat call tower you can hear from here the cat crying it sounds so sad the tower was built on that island a long time ago say there's a huge cat statue at the top it used to be a real cat before but after it lived for a long time really long time it turned into a god then it built the tower to watch over the world from the top the tower was so high the cat got scared and couldn't come down it was up there for so long that it turned to stone in the end. Oh, It's been alone up there ever since. That's why it cries like that, even now. Isn't that just the saddest story you've ever heard? It is! I need to go up there and I need to save the cat! Okay, where is it? It's over there. I'm gonna get over there. But imagine pissing Thor off so much that he's just like... Loki... I will personally ensure that your bones never have a chance to recover by smashing them to bits every chance I get. Moral of the story, don't make stuff sad. Yeah, Thor, Thor will fuck you up, man. Thor, Thor knows who, who, who buttered his bread. And it isn't his father's blood brother. It's his wife who will kill him. True. Shaving your head was a sign of uh, dishonor in that, that in that culture. Like you would think that Loki of all people would would understand that there are certain people you don't mess with, including the guy who beats the hell out of frost giants for fun. Oh no! I can't save the kitty. No! But how am I supposed to save the kitty? This is the worst ending. I can't get over there to save the kitty. Arca! Oh crap. Let's try making it daytime. Orca, hurry up so I can go save the kitty! Something's coming! Oh, guys, don't worry, I speak well! Why does this big fish look so happy? It's kinda creeping me out! Ah! Orca! Orca, it's you! It's been a dog's age! I stopped counting the years. Did you come to take me back to the Dragon Palace? Oh no! Poor buddy! Orca? Isn't that emissary or whatever of the Dragon Yet with Dragonians? Dragon Palace Emissary, Orca. Oh crap! I forgot! Orcas are dolphins! I don't speak dolphin, I only speak whale! At last! What worthy of visiting the Dragon Palace! Hop on, I'll take you to the Dragon Palace! Hey, right, Emmy! I'm second to none when it comes to swimming! Even that water dragon's no match for me! You heard him. What are we gonna do, Emmy? Oh, I guess you already made up your mind. No, Emmy, Emmy, can you get into the thing, please? Thank you. This is Arca? Hey, not a very creative name. He looks kind of fishy. Unintended. Wanna hit a ride? 
Right on Orca? Yes, please. You do? Well, I don't suppose we have much choice. You might as well take advantage of him now that he's there. I'm second to none when it comes to swimming. That water dragon's no match for me. Hey, that at me. You believe him? Maybe we should have him take us to the dragon palace. I'm afraid I can't do that yet. Huh? You must complete the final ordeal decreed by Odohime. Only then you'll be worthy of visiting the dragon palace. Sorry, my dolphin is a bit rusty. And hey, that at me. Hey, Arca, is this Odohime chick your boss or something? Got a lot of nerve letting that water dragon run amok. Listen, Orca, we want to ride down to the Dragon Palace. So let's hear about that ordeal you were talking about. The entrance to the Dragon Palace is a whirlpool. But it's hidden. No, not Otahimi. Orahimi. Orahime. Right now, it's to keep the evil out that belongs to Blaze's area. You must find the whirlpool amid the vast sea. That is the ordeal decreed by Otohime. What is Otohime? Whoops, I can't read. Hear that, Emmy? Sounds like a piece of cake. I mean, this sea is packed with places begging to be explored. We just have to check them out till we find that whirlpool. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Otohime. <clears throat> Otohime. But what are we waiting for? Spoil the Full speed ahead, fish brat. Faster, faster, faster! Now I can go save the kitty! Now I can go save the kitty and nobody can stop me! Ha ha! So I am faster than the water dragon. Where's that mailing coming from? Yeah, it's supposed to come from in there. Kinda creepy, but let's go check it out. Woo! Take that, water dragon, now I can go save the cat. I can go be friends with the kitty. And I'm gonna feed these kitties here. Good kitties! Meow 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 Oh whoops You know I keep going on this quest to to beat up the water dragon But the game keeps wanting me to do other things and honestly I'm fine with that I am totally down for saving this kitty Befriending this cat Nekogami! Huh, sounds like that annoying meow is coming from the top of the shirt. Isun! That is disgraceful! Hey, look at those little paw prints on the wall! Isn't that the market catwalk? It's one of the 13 celestial fresh techniques. Wait, maybe that means. <clears throat> oh! It's three sides! There's three sizes into one! Oh, it's fine, don't worry. I know how to beat you. Is this the cat from Zodiac? Uh, as far as I'm aware, the only Zodiac I can think of is the Japanese one. Or the Chinese one? So I'm gonna go with unlikely. <clears throat> Take that, punk. Wasn't my finest work, but I got the job done.
punched the treasure chest. I obtained the mark of Kabigami. Kabigami? What kind of- what kind of cat god is called Kabigami? Oh my goodness, there's another kitty. There you go, kitty, have some fish. <clears throat> uh, Neko! Neko Ami! The cat takes the place of the rabbit in some zodiacs? Uh, but there was a rabbit earlier. Here you go, kitty. Oh, I can love something up. Um, yeah, let's upgrade my purse. Though there is that story that the rat tricked the cat into being late for the banquets of the emperor, so they weren't given a year. Um... Horse, pig, rabbit, dragon... Tiger. There's a year of the tiger. In Chinese culture. Um... I know, I know the story about the frog and why the the frog made it so that way um, <clears throat> that, that people are mortal which is a very sad story there's the poor poor doggy tried his hardest but the frog outsmarted him well you know motto I mean leap before you look Oh my goodness, I'm spider Emmy. Yes, we did read that one in Hellboy. spider Emmy, spider Emmy, does whatever a spider Emmy can. Can he jump on the wall? Yes, he can, cause he's spider Emmy. Look out, here comes the spider Emmy. Hey, hey, what's gotten into you, Emmy? Trying to get to the top of the tower or something? You want enthusiastic furball. <gasps> There's a kitty here! Here, kitty, eat up. Have, have some, have some fish, kitty. Don't worry, kitty, I'm almost there. No! No!
Here you go, kitty. You get some food, too. Hopefully I don't have to feed too many cats going up because I'm almost out of food! I'm out of fish food! I just have one more bag left. I can feed one more cat. This is the worst ending. Also, wow, that's a far drop now. What's up, Kelsey? If I run out of cat food, I'm just gonna drop to the bottom and go buy more cat food and then come back up. Like, I don't even care. About the progress that I would have lost. What matters more to me is feeding all of these cats. I obtained a traveler's charm. See, but Cory, wouldn't you agree that feeding all of the cats is important as well? I will come back to save the kitty, but I need to ensure that I have enough cat food to feed every cat. If I run out of cat food, then, then it's, it's bad. So, if my theory is right, I should have two more floors of cats that I now can't feed. Exactly, I have to make sure that I have food for all the kitties. Okay, no cats on this floor. That's a holy bone. Not gonna lie, this cat kind of sounds like a like like a whale. I am almost there, my friend. Oh no! This is what I was afraid of. There's a cat here, isn't there? Okay, there's no cat here either. I obtained a lacquer rare set. Okay. That's good, that's good. The fact that there are less cats up here is actually really good. Because it means there aren't cats that I'm not feeding. You know, I told myself I needed to buy more food, too, and I just forgot to do it. I got a stray bead! Okay, the next floor should be the top. Unrelated? You know how I tell you guys that I have a... a fair of a lot of things? And how, uh... I'm very... I'm trying to be very careful with some words I use. Um, I do in fact have a fair fights, and it's really bad, let me tell you. Oh, what? I can walk on that? That's so cool. Um, oh, did a cat touch you? Um, so yeah, my fair fights is so bad that I am actually getting, like, slight vertigo playing this. <laughs> I 
I have Tinder Mermaid coin. It's fine, we made it to the top. Don't you worry your head, my my pretty little cat friend. I'm almost there. Kitty. Emmy, look, there's a kitty cat over there. What was doing all up here up below? Couldn't have climbed all the way up here by itself, could it? Sure, there could be, be anything up here, all the, anything to eat all the way up here. No! No! I'm out of cat food! Uh, I gotta go use this. Stupid mermaid coin. Head all the way back down. Get the cat food. Come all the way back up. I knew this was gonna happen. It's fine, we just need to go find a merchant. Um, Ryashima Coast had a merchant. Yes. Now go spend all my money on cat food so this never happens again. I need to buy a, a mermaid coin and a whole bunch of cat food. I need to fill up all my food bags, to be honest. Merchant! Merchant, show me your wares! I am in dire need. Five of those. Let's buy. Let's make sure I have 20 feed, ba feed bags on me at any given time. I have the money for it. I don't care about this other stuff. Let's, see, let's actually see if I have any of these things I want to sell. Okay, so let's sell this. Um, sell these, sell this, okay. and I'll keep everything else. <clears throat> okay, now we gotta go back to that mermaid pool, hop in, head back up to the tippity top. I mean, you gotta get down, gotta get down, don't want to fall on. the snow on the tunnels and bridge. The bus is apparently stalled at the causeway off of Cape Breton for an hour due to high winds. Oh no! I saw a tweet about being stuck but I didn't see uh, why. Don't you worry, kitty. I'm on my way. And I have enough food for you to eat until you're stuffed. She hasn't even made it off the first island yet. 
That is horrible. There you go, buddy. Okay. Okay, all is good, guys. All is good. Okay. No. Okay, come, you got me. It's not me, Owen. Hmm? Constellation? Hair? Yeah? Ah, I'm with the Rasu. Orange and all that is good and mother to us all. The sword and whirlpool of evil below has driven me to this height. From this perch I observe the world below in its descent. My power is needed once again. I, Kamigami, god of walls shall gladly offer a bridge of hope to the realm below. I love how the cat is the, uh, the god of walls. <clears throat> because you know cats have that magical ability where they can just, like, get to the top of walls when there's no, like, ledges or anything. You're just like, how did you get up there, cat? How did you do this? Hey, I'm not your personal toy to be played with. Like that. Wait a sec, that must have been Kabigami, one of the 13 gods! You know, the one with the catwalk brush technique? And this kitty right here is a messenger of the gods. God of the catwalk. And now I thought it was uh, some stray cat. Whoa, check it out! Statue's starting to glow! Oh, I get it. The Kabigami statue is telling you to use the catwalk power. Amy, anyway, put your brush on the statue and draw a line up the wall. That'll let you transfer the god's catwalk power into the wall. Meow 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 Yes, yes! Wait, look at that Amy, the marker Kabigami has appeared. On that path you draw you thing. Then you can climb walls anytime you want. Simply by summoning the market Kabigami, just like that. Speaking of which, remember those other Kabigami statues we saw? We should try a new brush technique on them too. Yes, I can climb up so many things now! Just like a real cat. Whoa, there's one big kitty statue. This must be the top of the tower. Doesn't that wind feel great? Okay, I guess I'm gonna just jump down. I obtained a sun fragment. Okay, you guys, ready to see the best thing about this game? 
The best thing about this game is I don't take fall damage. Cannonball! And who said only cats landed on their feet? I have Dander Crystal. I got a stray bee. As befitting, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. Okay, Erica, we got business to do. Hi, Erica! Away! Okay, next thing I want to do is I want to go over to this island here and beat up that, uh, that fruit for for Yoichi. Dig, 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 dig. Parades bound to Amaterasu. Ah, this guy that's happened just burst with blossoms. He's starting to bear fruit. Of course, it's not ripe yet, so keep your furry paws off. You obtained a traveler's charm. Okay, I guess there is no way for me to deal with that fruit. Yes, 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 Orca, I know. Oh my goodness, these stupid dolphins. They're all like, oh look at me, I'm a pretty little dolphin. Oh hey look, there's only island. Fish are friends, not food. Except for dolphins. Just jumping around going, oh look at me, I'm a pretty little dolphin. You do some tricks there, you give me a fish. Stupid dolphins.
Fish are friends, not food. Oh no, there's a water dragon! I have accidentally found him. Run away, Yorka! Run away! Let's go climb that wall instead. Swim faster, Yorka! Swim faster! There's the dragon behind us! Ha! Take that, you water dragon! I outswam ya! Cause you're a chump! Man, these kids are jerks again? I have a word with them. Oh, they're f apologizing. Good. Stupid brats. Hi, my name's Dory, and uh... I don't think I've ever eaten a fish. <gasps> Is an inspiration to us all. Yum 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 yum. Pretty sure the PB sub is worth it just for that emote. You are not wrong. Oh no! What is this? It's some kind of oni. Digivolt! That's cheating! Effective advertising. Huh? Someone there? What's up, Mr. Watcher, dude? This is Watcher's Cape. It is said the gods once used this place to return to the heavens. At night, this place offered a great view of the starry sky. Even the Whirlpool Galaxy was visible from the Cape's tip. Whirlpool Galaxy? It's a group of stars. They form the shape of a great spiral, like a heavenly whirlpool. As soon as the demon-shaped island appeared out at sea, there are more and more monsters about in the skies of Dold. The magnificent starry view can no longer be seen! You can't see the stars in the middle of the day. When night falls, I've got a wish to make upon a shooting star. If you wish upon a star, it always comes true. Even the whirlpool galaxy might appear in the sky again. Wow, developers, that was super subtle. Let me just casually destroy the ecosystem and make it nighttime. Again. I'm here in the hope that I'll be able to make a wish. You'd have to actually start watching your streams regularly and feel like you could justify it. Mood. Mm -hmm. Well, shooting stars are rare now, not like before. Mm -hmm. 
<sighs> if only a star would shoot across the night sky, then I could make a wish upon it. If you wish upon a star, it always comes true. Even the whirlpool galaxy might appear in the sky again. Why don't you stand next to me and help me look for shooting stars? Hmm. I feel like I have to create the shooting star. There we go. There! A shooting star! I've got to make my wish right now. My wish that the sky will lose making difference in this world in the past! Now the whirlpool galaxy will be visible again. That's it! The whirlpool galaxy! My wish really did come true. Watchers keep. When the whirlpool of galaxy spins in the distant heavens, a whirlpool shall open up below. And we have a feeling we'll be seeing that entrance real soon. Cool, cool. Wow, check out that whirlpool of stars. Yeah, the challenges you're sub to are the three I watch with any degree of regularity. It's like a huge windmill in the night sky. They say the whirlpool galaxy is the key to the dragon palace. So then the whirlpool entrance should be somewhere under it. Hmm. Hmm. This thing looks pretty calm to me. The whirlpool galaxy isn't even swirling. What do we gotta do to make the whirlpool entrance appear? Isn't it obvious, Amaterasu? We gotta make it swirl! I think you're onto something. We were supposed to blow that starry whirlpool around and around. Try it again, Amy! Keep using the wind power of yours! Dizzy and well, a bunch of other ones that you put on in the background while you're working on stuff, but the ones you give money to are the ones I actually engage in. Same. Look! The whirlpool entrance to the Dragon Palace. And there's Felicia, who I do watch when she's online, but you only had to pay her once. The whirlpool Galaxy's bringing it to the surface. Okay, I mean, it's about time we got on down to the Dragon Palace. The Cotuzo Dragonians a lesson. Okay, Orca, where'd you go, buddy? There you are, buddy. Jump! Damn it, I missed. Hi, yo, Orca, away! I've never insulted Orca. Swim faster! We made it to the whirlpool. <laughs> the 
the Dragon Palace. Finally, Amy, we made it through that whirlpool down to the bottom of the sea. It must be the Dragon Palace in the Kingdom of the Dragonians. The leader Orohime controls the water dragon. Better not let her go down. Am I underwater? Why am I still subject to this stupid gravity thing then? I should be able to swim! Oh my goodness, am I gonna get to do musical stuff now? Under the sea. Under the sea. Darling, it's better. Down where it's wetter. Take it from me. Upon the land, they work all day. Down in the sea, we love to play. Under the sea. This isn't Kingdom Hearts. Lame. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. Let's play for a little bit longer. I still have time. Hold you, white beast! What business do you have in the Dragon Palace? You talking to us? The Dragonian Kingdom is no place for land dwellers. State your name. Ah, yes, casual racism. Who do you think you are talking to us like that? Besides, you're the ones who led that water dragon run amok. I'm Essen, wandering artist and protector of Queen Emiko, ruler of Seiyan City. Now hurry up and go fetch your leader, Orohima, for me. Chop, chop! I have no time for lowly servants. Himiko? Queen Himiko from Seiyan City? Then that white beast must be. Hey, what are you two babbling about? You wanna get Orohime or not? This way, O Beast of White, our Royal Highness will receive you in the throne room. Why do I have the, the vaguest recollection of Susa Sanctuary? This place seems familiar. Hmm. What's up, Orihime? Welcome, both of you. Welcome to the Dragon Palace. You are in the kingdom of the Dragonians now. I couldn't care less who or what you are. All I'm interested in is that lady sitting on a rump over there. That's your leader, right? Well, we have some choice words for her. Yes. It is I, Otohime, ruler of the Dragon Palace and leader of the Dragonians. This is how I imagine people underwater sound. Leader of the Dragonians, Otohime. Uh, uh, <clears throat> anyway, we wanted to ask you something. You know that water dragon that's been running the muck lately? It's under your control, right? But why don't you keep that thing on a leash? And what's with sending your emissary to come get us? Are you really that desperate? The Dragonians are prepared to do whatever is necessary. Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. What the? You know about Ami? The water dragon is our guardian deity and protector of the seas. He kept the peace by pacifying chaos whenever it reared its head. That all changed just one month ago. Only Island, the dark place of ancient legend suddenly appeared. Evil begins evil beings swarmed into the sea and laid siege to the Dragon Palace. We mustered our forces to battle, but the enemy was too strong. Most of the realm fell into the hands of the forces of darkness. It was then that the water dragon appeared. With overwhelming strength it routed the enemy's forces. With the enemy's leader, the Dark Lord, had unimaginable power. The Water Dragon nearly fell in the face of Onslaught. So grave were his wounds that he flew into an uncontrollable rage. The Dark Forces then pulled back from the sea, 
leaving behind these chaotic waters plagued by the rampaging dragon. So you're staying back control of the water dragon! We never had control of the water dragon. It is our guardian deity. But its madness now endangers us as much as anyone else. You've gotta be kidding me! The water dragon is supposed to break the Barononi Island! What hope do we have of attacking the enemy if it won't help us? Indeed, there is little hope left. It appears that all is gone as the Dark Lord planned. Oh my goodness, he who shall not be named is in this game! Oh my goodness, I'm trying to talk to her! Would you like to listen to her royal highness once more? No? Please wait. It is true we cannot control the water dragon. However, there is still a way to harness its power. There is? Then why didn't you just say so? It is the deed of last resort and fraught with grave danger. Alas, it is beyond our power. That is why we summoned you, Amaterasu. You probably want us to go tie a leash around the dragon, right? Well, we're not going to do anything like that. I don't think we could put it off or anything. Right, I mean, I mean, Aqua would probably help us out, right? This deed of last resort is as follows. You must retrieve the dragon orb. Dragon orb? What's that? You think we can just forget about the water dragon and go hunt for the dragon orb thing? Sounds like a piece of cake. I mean, we're treasure hunting pros. We already know the location of the dragon orb. It lies in the belly of the water dragon. It was into the water dragon's body. Come again. You're joking, right? The dragon orb is the essence of the water dragon's power. With it in my possession, I could easily break through the barrier that protects only island. Will you not enter the water dragon through its gaping jaws and retrieve the dragon orb that lies deep in its belly? With that, I could break the barrier that protects only island. Now wait just a second, lady. Go get some oil from the water dragon's stomach? Am I on candid camera? Are you nuts? That is the only way left to break the barrier on Oni Island. Will you not enter the water dragon through its gaping jaws and retrieve the dragon orb that lies deep in its belly? No, I'm not supposed to kill her dad. I'm supposed to just get the dragon orb. With it, I can break the barrier that protects Oni Island. Whoa, slow down there, sister! I make it a habit of never saying no to a pretty face. But if my boss says, says no, there ain't much I can do. Well, boss, we gonna help this chick or what? Of course we're gonna help her. Bummer! Well, the boss has spoken! Huh? But, but Abby! Oh, great Abby Tarasu, your compassion is truly as deep as the sea. And you are quick to decide. This amulet will allow you to enter the water dragon's garden. I've changed the shell amulet. Water dragon's garden? That is correct. The water dragon makes its lair in a garden here at the palace. Here? At this palace? That thing lives here? It does, but it will not attack us as long as we leave it be. I doubt we could come out alive if we entered its lair. But I truly believe that Amaterasu can retrieve the dragon orb. I shall pray for your safe return. Well, I guess we're gonna go get Vord. Look at the mess we're in now. Why you always so we get a please? Ah, forget it. Let's go get that bra barrier breaking orb. The water dragon garden should be around there somewhere. Down, 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 down. Well, if there's anything like Susa Sanctuary, I can guess where it is. Ryugujo. Oh, you got a shell amulet, so you have the permission of Otohime. Forgive my rudeness, you may pass. Ryugujo. Excuse me, pardon me. Just gotta dig up right there. Many much thanks. Oh! Why are you digging this dried up spring, doggy? You're to smash the rock under the spring to find more water, are you? You must have a good nose, that was my plan too! Come on then, doggy! Help me dig down under the spring! 
Let's see if we can smash through the rock and revive the spring. Yeah, sure. Okay then, here we go. I'll tell you how we're gonna dig through. Although I guess you're pretty good at digging already, huh? Once I'm down to the deepest rock, I'll hit it as hard as I can. You just focus on digging and get to, get me down to the deepest point. Got it? Or do you want me to explain that again? No, I got it. I've done this a few times now. Yeah, it's really cool. Um, I was talking to one of the, uh... Oh, dang it. I was talking to one of the, uh, the kids who came down for some foreign exchange thing. And she's, she was telling me that in Japan, they don't have the letter R. Stop. Emmy! Stop! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, why would it do what I'm trying to tell it to do? Keep dropping it over there.
Come on, hurry up. Oh my goodness. Let's give this one more try. Now that I see how annoying this is gonna be. and recharge. Why does it take forever to recharge?
Hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Find it. Right there. Okay. We did it. We did it, chat. We found it. Okay, let's go save the game and call it a day because I need to leave soon. But we fixed the spring! Yeah, right on! Woohoo! It smashed right through that rock. Look at that, it's pretty discussion again. Er, uh, spring's running again, but. That'll. But okay. But what? Until you get net. Nope, it doesn't. There we go. I fixed it. I made the mermaid spring. Ah, I'm a so origin of all that is good and mother to us all. Followers in need and your own pure heart have restored my power. I, Nurigami, have a new power to bestow upon you. I have harnessed the fervent energy of those in need to create the power called Fountain. Use it well. Does this mean I get to splash people now? Do I get to create water? Yeah, right on! Woohoo! Swirly Whirly's return to the spring! Swirly Whirly's real name is the Spoiling Spring. The portal that the Draconians made to connect it to the land. When you jump in when it's swirling, you can go to different places. Sometimes we girls use it to get out and have some fun on land. Whoops, you won't tell Lord Ohime about that, will you? Anyway, thanks for all your help, doggy. Hey, have this, you'll be surprised at what's inside. I knew it! Brute strength is the only answer in the end. From now on, the Dragon Palace dance troops' motto is muscle. Oh, well, uh, good luck with that. Boy, I mean, that's one mean brush you wield. I bet you could summon one of those time travel, one of those travel whirlpools at any time. If you want to use the sport technique on a mermaid spring. Oh, we can travel across Nippon for free! Wow. So I just bought four mermaid coins for no reason. Guess it pays to help people every now and then. I just, I just bought four mermaid coins for literally no reason. I obtained the water spray tech. I'm not salty. You're salty. Anyways, let's go save the game. Because I need to leave. I got people to go. Things to see, places to do. Save it again. All right. Um. <laughs> uh, tomorrow's Friday, right? Tomorrow. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do tomorrow yet. Uh, but I might play more Okami. Uh, I feel like I feel like I should play more Okami tomorrow. I don't know yet. I'll let people know what the plan is for tomorrow on Twitter. But until then, be excellent to one another, party on dudes, and remember, McNeuto was right.